Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with yet another video about Korea and today I'm gonna show you what I've bought during my trip to Korea. So, I'm gonna show you the very first thing I bought, uh, which is my line wear. So as you know, Korea is very popular with the line shop. So, we went to the store at Everland and this is what I've got. I just bought one thing and out of that they even gave us a free um, keychain because I think we spent over a certain amount yeah so this is the line wear another popular thing to get in Korea is the Korea socks and you can get 11 pairs for 10,000 won so these are a few designs that I've got the Boomin Sesame Street some uh, white bear and I don't I bought many many designs but I've given uh, some of them to my family members so yeah okay so the next one will be the hand cream so I bought many uh, hand creams this time round maybe about 10 bottles of it because uh, I think they are very nice as a gift and each of them cost about 1000 uh, to less than 2000 won so this particular ones are from Daiso and it's only 1000 won and these two are from Artbox uh, and they are 1200 won I went there during their cherry blossom season so or even their hand creams are all cherry blossom fragrance <laughs> so yeah I've never really uh, opened it to try because uh, it's sealed. So, so yeah, I bought a lot of these for my uh, friends and family this time around as well. And also, uh, other than the, um, the hand creams, I also bought this cherry blossom um, design uh, nail polish from Daiso for 3000 won. So yeah, inside there's three bottles of very very nice pink color, which is my favorite color as well. So I bought it. And this time round, I even bought a lot of tote bags from Korea. Some of them are from Artbox, some of them are from Daiso, and the Artbox one costs between two to three thousand, and the Daiso one is also about three thousand. And I've also bought another one over at the Hanok Bookshop area. This is 7,000 won. Three different tote bags from three different places that I've got. And the, I've also got a shoe. This shoe is from Spau. So you can see here. It's a, the Korea fashion label. So, me just to show you guys this is the design that I've got it's a peach uh, design shoe with a little bit of platform and it's in pink which is why I bought it as well and they have uh, four different designs uh, actually when I first saw this I liked it but it's retailing for 19,900 won which is about uh, 24 dollars $24, dollars at the point in time, I'm not really keen in getting it because it's very bulky and I've already gotten so many snacks and lotte mud that my luggage, there's no space in my luggage already. But the next day, we went back to a spa because we were living uh, at the Myeongdong area and they have discount for this shoe. And it's only retailing for $12,900, which is about uh, $15 for this pair of shoes. So basically, after seeing the sales, I decided to just go get this shoe. So yeah, here's the shoe and I think for the design, it's very good for everyday wear and some maybe casual pairing with even shorts or jeans. So yeah, I really like the design and I like the color as well. So I've got it. Yeah. And I think you cannot leave Korea without getting their makeup products. I bought mainly their uh, masks. And I've got these two from Nature Republic. So one pack of 10 is 12,000 won. I got two for 24,000 won. I've been using their food peeling mask for a while, so I went there and top up to get some more. So this is 
40,000 won for 10 pack. And next, I went to um, Innisfree in Jeju and I just got a pack of this, a pack of fire masks because uh, it's their collection. <laughs> I've also gotten from Etude House the nose peeling mask. Basically, it's the two, two are the same. So I got one pack of 10 for 5,000 won. And I've also gotten from Skin Food their nose peeling mask as well. And another um, two very normal cotton masks from Nature Republic. I've also went to the face shop to get um, their removal tissue. And it's actually selling and it's actually selling uh, five packs for fifteen thousand won. And the reason why I got it is because the salesperson put me in. And I feel like I have to go inside and get something, which is why I've gotten this. But also of course I needed I wanted to find a makeup remover tissue as well. So this is the one I've got. And also at Inishri Jeju, I've gotten this Jeju Volcanic Pore Clay Mask. So I think it, their clay mask are, is very popular. So it's made of um, Jeju Volcanic material and it's mainly for to maintain your pores. I bought just one bottle to try out because I think I read online that uh, as soon as you open it, it gets dry very it gets dry easily, so you cannot use it for too long. But um, I think yeah, it's not even sealed as well, so I don't think I can keep it for so long. So that's why I don't want to buy so many bottles. Otherwise, uh, there's no point if it's if it's dry, right? And also, we went over to Gangnam's underground shopping center and got a few uh, very basic shirts. So just to show you guys, I've got a very basic stripe uh, crop top which I really like because I like this kind of material of clothing. And I've also gotten a basic t-shirt for Totoro. So I've got these two basic shirts from the Gangnam Underground Shopping Center. And they are retailing for about 5,000 to 10,000 won per shirt, which I think is very reasonable to get uh, to spend 5,000 to get just a very basic crop top. That's why I've gotten um, about 4 pieces from that particular shop. Moving on back to Myeongdong, I've got this um, skirt. It's actually the mermaid uh, style at the bottom and I think it's really pretty. And also, um, in Korea, they are also very popular for their fila. So I went over and got one uh, fila pullover in pink. And I also bought a uh, Another pullover from Spao. They are having a collaboration for We Wear Bears. So there's a very cute uh, mustard color pullover that I got. So as you can see, in Korea there are a lot of cute items and I had a hard time resisting. Even their shoe is so cute. Like, like seriously? <laughs> how, can, how can they make their shoe so cute as well? Yeah. So other than makeups, I'm sure there are a lot of other things to get in Korea. And if I can, I'll definitely buy a lot more back. But because I'm limited by the luggage space, I can't really get a lot of things that I wanted. That's the end of my video. Do remember to like and subscribe and comment down below if you have anything you want to ask me about the things I've mentioned in this video. And see you next time. Bye!